Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. So, big fan of crime videos in general, just to understand the law as an American. I think we all should, uh, just to make sure that the police doesn't get over on you. However, came across this channel, Code 3, and they showed a neighborhood in Florida. Now, everything seems normal, right? I mean, it's typical. They look like they're young kids. A couple of things. I want, and I want y'all to check out this video. Tell me, I'm going to put the link in the description. A couple of things I noticed. Number one, I seen a young lady, a young girl. She had to be at least, I don't know, 15 or younger, getting smart with a 38-year-old woman. That's already sign number one. And then... Apparently they was fighting before a bunch of people went over there and wasn't nobody even gonna go to jail at all. Nothing was planned on happening. And next thing you know, these people start fighting in front of the police. So let me just pause and play this real quick video, fair use, and go please go check out this video from Code 3. Okay, why can't you guys stick her as well? Because. Hey, 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 come back here, hold on. What's your name again? Shania. S-H-A-E-I-Y-E. Knowing that you've been trespassed from this place, you understand? I'm gonna go. <laughs> okay, come here. I need your right thumbprint over here. Mid. No, your right thumbprint. Hold a bit down. Hey, your tongue. Hey, come over here, come over here. Yeah, I love people. Yeah, that's oh, them yeah. Come over here, come here, come here. It's only fair. See? See? Yeah. Come on. Hey! Come here, come here. That whole should have been, been doing all that when I was Okay, that been doing all that when I was See? 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 What's up? 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 All right, and again, fair use. As y'all can see, these people started fighting in front of the police. Now, the young lady who ended up getting detained, ironically, I got a daughter that's older than her, right? And I got another daughter that's around her age. And they think that we're so old, right? I'm in my 30s. And people think that, you know, if you was born from 1997 and back, you so old. But it was just a couple of. Just a couple of decades ago. Right. And we wasn't perfect. But one thing that we didn't do, we didn't fight in front of the damn police. You. You. You know, y'all might have, you know, y'all fight. But when you see adults come out there, you get the scanner. And, and people was people still respected their elders. Now, my generation up, our grandparents and great grandparents was even born in the early 1900s. So we still had that respect level. But this is how far we've fallen back to where people want to fight in front of the police. Now, one thing that we've known about the police is they can be a little quick to pull out some weapons to where you cross over into history and instead when the police get there you know first all all you had to do was sign your trespassing paper and go on about your way but when the police get there y'all start fighting and then but what if something okay what if something wild would have happened then what now you got people out here crying and saying it ain't right and is police brutality and but y'all people are fighting in front of the police anything could happen somebody could have had a weapon and pull it out and now these people got a split second to make a decision we got to do better man we got to teach our youth better man we we can't be doing stuff like this i tell my daughters and i tell my son this all the time man you don't you don't one thing you don't, you don't disrespect grown folks and you don't fight in front of the, in front of grown folks especially the police 
You know, I'm not going to be a hypocrite. I understand sometimes I'd rather people fight it out than, than shoot it out, right? Because when you shoot it out, it's permanent. If they get hit and, you know, a lot of times it's permanent. However, what happened to back in the day where y'all get to fight and you hear, hey, hey they calling the police. And all you seen was people take off running. Y'all know what I'm talking about because didn't nobody want those kind of problems. Now, technology was different back then, so maybe that had a little bit to do with it. But come on now, what what's the what can happen when you fight in front of the police? What positive can happen? So that's just my two cents on it. I want y'all to watch the video, and I want y'all. Am I tripping, y'all? What do y'all What do y'all teach y'all y'all nieces and y'all daughters and y'all sons and and nephews and little cousins? Because is this just me? Am I di am I that disconnected from? Was it that long ago to where we didn't change from fighting in front of the pol or running from the police to now fighting in front of the police? Y'all let me know in the comment section.